It's uh, been almost a month now since Congressman Greg Stubbe suffered a serious injury or two after mm -hmm. falling 25 feet while trimming a tree at his home. And today he returned to Sarasota Memorial Hospital to personally thank the trauma team who helped save his life. News Channel 8's Brittany Muller joins us now live from Sarasota Memorial. Brittany, how is the congressman doing? Well, I have to tell you, he's making some serious progress, and he says that he's so thankful for the team here at Sarasota Memorial Hospital and all that they've done through his recovery. Congressman Greg Stubbe is thankful for Sarasota Memorial Hospital, calling it a treasure in our community. These are the unsung heroes in our community that every day go to work and are saving people's lives. On January 18th, Stubbe was cutting a tree limb with a chainsaw about 25 feet up on a ladder at his Sarasota home. The limb let go, hit the extension ladder, knocked me up into the air. Stubbe fell to the ground. An Amazon driver who witnessed the congressman's accident called 911. Everything that I witnessed, for the most part, it was more of like a blink of an eye. SMH highly specialized team treated Stubbe for three nights in the trauma center and ICU. He suffered a concussion, broken pelvis, a punctured lung, and several torn ligaments in his neck. It's a miracle that I'm here. It's a miracle that um, I'm so recovered as, as I am at this point. A month later, Stubbe returned to SMH. The congressman presented an American flag that flew over the nation's capital to show his gratitude to the team for their extraordinary work in the community. The mortality rates for our trauma patients are significantly better than any national benchmark. That means when every second can can mean the difference between life and death, our community can count on our trauma team. SMH opened its level two trauma center in 2015, serving more than 4,800 patients annually. Congressman Stubbe is expected to be cleared to fly next month, which means he'll be heading back to our nation's capital. Reporting live from Sarasota tonight, Brittany Muller, eight on your side.